Hi there! Welcome back to Korean with Rose. Today we're going to talk about some basic conjugation. Conjugation is basically just leaving the word stem there and then changing the word ending. Today's going to be about basic change in tense. How to describe the present tense and how to describe the past tense. Those two are today's topic. The first one, present tense, a o y u The second one, past tense, a o s o y u So, what this dash means. Word stem here. Then what's the word stem? But word stem only exists in verbs or adjectives. For example, 먹다, 자다, 가다. These are the basic verbs. In Korean, yepuda, yepuda, o k o c h i l d a m o k c h a k a These are where the meaning is. m o k d a to eat, c h a d a to sleep, k a d a to go. Those meaning are all in. m o k t a k a Not in ta, not in da, not in ta. Same thing here with in adjectives. y e p p u has the meaning of pretty. k o t i has the meaning of harsh. Ta has no meaning. It's just there to make it into a basic form. If you want to describe an action or a state so that it implies it's a present tense, then that's when we should use this. A o y u A o y u A y u or o y u is combined with a verb or an adjective describing an action. Or a state. So when do we use ayu and when do we use oyu? We use ayu when the vowel is a, o, o. When the vowel is a, o, o, then we use ayu. And if it's not a, o, o, Then we use oyu. For example, chada. We get rid of ta here and then look at the vowel here. The vowel is a, right? Then we use ayu. Ayu. Then it becomes ta ayu. So you might think, um, well, ta ayu. Ta ayu. Ta ayu. I've never heard of this before. Yeah, you're right. We don't use, we don't say ta ayu. We only say ta ayu. It's because this a is used twice. So we don't like using it twice. So we get rid of a again and then it becomes cha yu. Cha yu. For example, with b o k d a on the other hand, when we get rid of ta, we look at the. We look at the. Um, vowel here, then it's not a o o. 
so we use oil. So it's bog oil. Although there's this o and there's this o, we have the same one twice, but there's this this sound here in the middle. So it's not bo you, it's bo and o you, bo go you. So there's this kiok in the middle. We don't get rid of this here. We just say bo go you. Okay? With adjectives, ko da. Get rid of ta. We have this vowel. This vowel here is not a o o, right? So we use i o u. So ko plus o u. So it becomes ko you. Okay. So this one was present tense. So, 자다 is to sleep. 자유, sleep. 먹어요, eat. 거칠어요, is harsh or tough. Present tense. But if we wanted to use past tense, then here comes... 왔어요 오 왔어요 So it's exactly the same. The rule is exactly the same. So when there's this vowel 아오 오 then we use 왔어요 and when there's this vowel not which is not 아 O, o, then we use osoyo. Asoyo. Osoyo. Okay. A, o, else. Okay. For example, ta, da. Get rid of ta. If we wanted to make it into a past tense, so if we wanted to say, I slept. We would look at the vowel here and it's a. So we use a soil. So ta a soil. But in this case, it's there's the same thing here twice. So we get rid of a and then it becomes ta so you ta so you okay and then bokta bokta we get rid of ta and then look at the vowel here it's not a o o so it's else we use o so you then it's o so you so you. Okay? I hope you liked this video. Remember when to use a oil and when to use a soil also. Okay? I'll see you in the next lesson. Until then, bye bye. Mwah.